Brawler. Rush. Dragon. Beast. Long ago, the four styles of fighting worked together in harmony, but everything changed when our friend betrayed us. Only Kiryu, the master of all four styles, could stop him. But when the Yakuza needed him most, he went to jail. Ten years passed, and Kiryu discovers the Yakuza is in disarray. Although his fighting skills were great, the ten years in prison made him rusty. But I believe Kiryu can save his loved ones. Damn, look at this guy. Look at this. Look at his jaw. Bro, we ain't trying to, bro. I try to speak sentence to you. You over here just chatting, bro. Like, come on. Bro, ain't no way we're in close quarters combat. And he just, like, automatically out of nowhere. Pick this up, bro. Realistically, you're not getting up from that. Let's be honest. Ain't no way. I'm about to die. Get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Hit him with this. Yes. This is like that show Prison Break. I got a drone footage of the whole, what? Now we got this big one punch man facial hair. Betrayed. We took the fall for him and he betrayed us. Oh, look at that. The uppercut from heaven. What am I saying? Uppercut from hell. Oh, no, no, no. Get in there. Oh, instant. Bro. Oh. Bro, so you couldn't help me. You was behind these doors. You're not here to commotion that was just outside. Bro, nah, he's against me, bro. He's, he's a, he, he betrayed me as well, bro. He ain't no way you behind. This is wood panels, bro. Like, you definitely heard me fighting my life for my life on the other side of that door. You did not come in so we could double team this guy. Come on, bro. You got to be smarter than that, bro, because ain't no way he didn't hear all that. That's tough. Ain't no way you know where that takes you either. Bro, your knees, bro. Oh, his knees, bro. There's no type of tuck and roll technique or nothing. He just like jumped and out the window. No roll, no nothing. His knees are in pain. He done tore ACL, BCL. Um red green blue wire i don't know bro. bro who is this guy bro you think you're something to me i just faced like 50 guys just face like 50 guys bro come on bro stop playing with me stop playing with me who are you to me oh nah bro that man's like six foot seven bro like come on bro look at that what am i do come on oh nah bro you should not be alive after that come on bro look at the fiery aura I have on me right now. Who are you? You see a man woke up to you with this type of aura, you gonna fight them? Like, you deserve this. Who are you? To be touching me? It's over. Stand straight to the Lord, bro. He's a Stand straight to the Lord, bro. Come on. Oh. One Punch Man took off his shirt. Kind of intimidating. Oh, hold on, we still going. Bro, look, bro, I'll fight all of y'all one by one. Y'all with nothing to me. Or blitz all of them, bro. Come on. You can bond. Oh, look what I got. Eyebrows. Ain't no way I got that way out of the way like that, bro. I got some reflexes that I don't have. That's some Yo, look how he's fighting these people, bro. Come on, bro. We box everybody, bro. Who is this guy that just saved you? You just run into random guys' call like that. So, if y'all want to see this as a series, let me know. Um, I personally don't know if I'll even do this as a series, but if y'all want me to do it, I'll do it. But um, I think I'll probably still go Bioshock, or I'll probably go into Resident Evil Four. Maybe. I heard one of my mans going into it. I think, I think I'll probably get into it. Or if y'all want, we could play some Outlast 2. 
And I don't know if y'all know this about me, but I, for the longest time, I could not play Outlast because it was too scary for me. So that was the first Outlast. Now I could play it because it's not as bad now. But Outlast 2, that right there shook my soul, bro. So if y'all want me to play it, let me know. And yeah, that's basically it.